Dude, what's up, you guys? The lighting is bad, so let me go turn it on. It would help if I actually had a light on. So, that just makes it slightly better. <laughs> hey, it's Ice for Bloss here, and I finally changed it. I'm tired as hell right now. So I ended up going on a Boy Scout summer camp with my crew. And I won't get into any details on that because that's personal privacy stuff. But let's just say it was somewhere in between extremely horrible and amazing. You figure it out. So, I should probably turn off the video that I'm watching because that could help with uh, copyright issues. Especially with a big company like them. Not gonna say who, you could probably guess, but not gonna say who. So as I was saying, this is Ice Purple Loss, and I have not made a Red Room video in a while. Because I haven't been here. So, instead of making a Red Room video, I thought I'd make another one of these just basic talk videos. So, trying to think of what to talk about, because like... So far, all that's happened is depressing stuff. So, um... Huh. Uh, I've lost seven pounds since the last time I went to the doctor, so I think that's good. Uh... I have uh, an obsession with Billy Mays and OxyClean. Um, five seasons of Pokemon are on Netflix, except they sort of messed up on the order stuff, so like, what should be season three, it's like parts of season two and three, and like, with the first and second season of Pokemon, that, that's what happened, it started off as, season, as one season of 52 episodes, went to a different season, and then it played off from there. And then they ended it. And then they had a new series, season. But the thing is, they didn't have the third season have parts of the Orange Islands. Well, maybe they did, I'm not 100% sure. The anime isn't my specialty. My specialty is the games and, my, and some cards. Because, like, uh, with the anime... It's inconsistent. With the games, it's less inconsistent. With the cards, they they don't really have a plot most of the time. So, that explains it. And, uh... I'm just glad to be home. I was way up near Moscow and Idaho the capital of Idaho, if you guys don't know. So, uh, it's actually closer to Potlatch. So, yeah. And, uh, my family's in Montana. I was like, like I was already told that they're going to Montana. Blah, blah, blah. But the microwave's broken, so. Like, I can't really make that much stuff, but I already went to the store and got some new stuff. But, uh, at the camp I earned two merit badges, the shotgun merit badge and the archery merit badge. Both you have to go through a class, you have to fill out a packet, have to qualify. And qualifications for shotgun were hard, but archery were extremely easy for me. Like, shotgun has... Afraid of the kick. Until I got used to it. Then I qualified. So I had to do it once. And then I had to do it again to qualify. With archery. I've been doing archery for years. They had long bows. And I have like a compound type of bow. So it's a little awkward at first. But after like nine practice shots. I started going for qualifying. And... 
I did not finish the rounds. You have ten rounds with each with three shots. One round has three shots. And at this point, I would have had maybe the highest score. I don't know about uh, one of the people in my group, but I ended at 182. I had three shots left, and I usually shoot around 21 points. Usually it's a 9, a 5, and a 7. Like, literally, like, three times I got a 9, a 5, and a 7. So, yeah, archery's my big class. I also took sustainability, which is a partial there, which means you only get part of it. Then pioneering, which is not usually a partial, but my specific class was really rowdy. So I, we didn't get through that much. But if I, but pioneering's uh, green, which means we don't need it. I had one silver in that sustainability. So, didn't really get any useful merit badges besides getting eagle count. Which basically means like, you get enough merit badges to get eagle scout. Right now I'm a first class scout, and, um... I think all I need is like the service project and then I'll be star, but I'm not sure. I need to get a new book. But anyways. So yeah, that's what I've been doing for the past week. Um played quite a bit of Pokemon Soul Silver. Didn't want to. But I did. Like you'd think, oh, you like Pokemon, why wouldn't you want to play it? Because I was at camp. Why would I want to play that camp? The point is to get merit badges. So, yeah. I've just been babbling for about seven minutes, and my parents shouldn't be home for a little more than 12 hours, so... Let's just keep talking, alright? Capiche? I've got nothing to do. I already did an hour talk once. Let's just going so like uh one of my old best friends from a little over seven eight months ago i was like i was thinking hey like his mom told me to give him time i gave him about seven eight months seven to eight months so i figured hey why not try again he doesn't want to be friends so that's that but, uh, I've got a lot of other friends, like, maybe, like, two of them. <laughs> well, three. That I hang out with, two. Friends that I talk to on a daily basis, none. Like, uh, um, one of my friends since first grade, which is almost, it's almost been ten years, It'll be ten years. Um, uh, this January, January twenty first, and my Benny's attacking a bee. Good Benny. Don't give me that look. He's just like giving me a look like, what? You said my name? And yeah, I said his name. I'm just messing with him, like, he doesn't understand my humor, but I don't, like, I, when I say stuff like that, I say it in a way that would register as a what, and not, oh, I'm sorry, or, oh, I'm a dog, like, if I said, Ben, don't give me that look, and you, like, you'd start wagging, yeah, he's wagging his tail right now. But, like, if I said, Benny, don't give me that look, he probably would have, like, cowered. Or something, maybe. But, uh, yeah. Uh, I didn't get any serious injuries at camp. I got a minor sunburn on my face. Um, sliced three of my toes open. 
one on a rock, one on a heat, one on a heater, and uh, I think the other one was on a tree stump. Yeah, it was on a tree stump at camp. So it was pretty fun, but uh, nothing beats being home after a week, almost a week of not being here. I think I'm sitting here with my pal Dressing. Dressing. And he just kicked me. So I've got to move the angle because, okay, okay, stop kicking me, please. So yeah. So I'm here alone. None of my friends I've tried contacting can hang out. So, I'm really bored. It's like, last week was like, the last, like, six days was like, almost no privacy. Like, everywhere you had to go outside of camp, you had to have a buddy. Besides, like, archery, because we were right next to it at camp. I'm not going to say the name, because, like, blah, 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 blah. But if you are in Boy Scouts and did my troop, then you probably know where we went. Oh, by the way, all you boys or young men or men under the age of 18, um, not next, not like the, this Monday, but like maybe the Monday after next, um, Come on down if you're interested in Boy Scouts or want to join a new group, which I think is very doubtful. Um, just uh, message me over Facebook and I can let you know the day and you can come on in. Might see some people you know and some meet some people you won't like and some people you will like. Yeah. So, like, I'm really, really thirsty right now, but I don't want to stop the video because then I'd have to actually edit it. Like, literally, I have no editing software because I do all my videos now on a tablet. And so, uh, yeah. Um, I've already introduced my dog, so... This was just a catch-up video. I'm going to go make a Red Room video. I'll see you guys soon.